Hi everyone, I'm Shane Stevenson, Director of Museum Collections and Curator, you know where, at the Buffalo Naval Park. And uh, for today's video, I'm going to feel a little bit like Bill Nye the Science Guy. Just a little bit. I'm not. But, take a look at this piece of aluminum. Aha! Where is it? There we go. We got a little hole in it. Okay, hopefully you can see that. The sun's blaring. It's a beautiful day down here in Buffalo. Uh, kind of getting ready to turn the corner on winter. And, all right, all right. there we go. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to demonstrate how we plug holes on USS the Sullivans from the bow of the USS Little Rock. <laughs> how about that? So we use three procedures to plug a hole when we find them. All right, and again, we're having the work done on the Sullivan, so hopefully this will keep us from having to do these procedures for the next 10, 15, 17 years. Again, I showed you the hole. There she is right there. Now, to review those three times, we do have a winter patching. That is where we cannot get in the water. All right, so I'm going to demonstrate that one first. All right, so use this as the hull of the Sullivans. In some spaces, she is just this thick. And what we take is what's called JB Weld. All right, it's, it's gray and black, and it's like steel. All right, so it does have steel components in it. All right, and what we would do is we'd roll it up into a ball, mix that black and gray. I don't know if you can see that, but there's black and gray in there. Mix it up pretty well. What we do is we put it on the hole. We would then secure it with this little uh, piece of gasket material, aluminum gasket. Put that right on there. And then because we're doing all this work in the winter time with no diver on the outside, we would then shore it. Like you've seen in a video, the most recent one was Brendan and I were down in one of the freshwater tanks. All right, and that's the inside shoring during the winter. Oh, look at that, JB Weld. I don't know if you could see that, but it went right through the hole and formed into the hole. So it went a little on the outside, what would be the outside of the hole. So again, JB Weld, aluminum gasket material, shoring. Now say John's in the water. It's now summertime. John's in the water, but he has to patch a hole by himself on the outside of the water. Hey guys. <laughs> So what do we do then? First off, John would take his sharpened aluminum stick here and he would scrape off all of the zebra mussels. So he goes around the hole right here, tries to get as smooth to the uh, steel as possible. He drops that in the water. He then would take, like, canvas. Now these were from uh, banners, so this is probably, you know, some rubber, polyester materials from, some, from uh, banners that we would hang, old banners. He would then put it over the hole. They're not going to stay for me, sorry. And then he would use one of these industrial magnets. And he would put it, again, This that would be steel. This is aluminum and it's not going to stick. But then he would secure that canvas, uh, that plastic material, with the magnet. Until someone was able to get onto the inside and then secure it with a patch. Alright, so this is the second version again. Alright, scraping away the zebra mussels, applying the canvas, or, uh, you know, the canvas or the banner material, 
and then securing it with these industrial magnets. The third way, and the really the best way, would be John's in the water, and typically it's been me on the inside. So what he does is he pounds around, we try to locate each other, once that's done, he has half a patch on the outside, I have half the patch on the inside, so he's swimming away down there in his diving outfit, here you go, there's a bolt, some rubber foam, and again, that aluminum gasket material. He would secure it, put the bolt through, can you see that right here, You'd put the bolt through. I would be standing on the inside. I would have a very similar, unfortunately I only found one of these, not, not the whole set. So just now imagine that this, this material is on the inside. I do have a little piece of rubber and a washer. I would be getting a face full of uh, river. The rubber would go on, the washer would go on, and then he is holding the bolt while I am securing the nut. And you tighten it down, inside and out, and there you go. You've got a secure patch. Again, that yellow material and the foam would also be on the inside as well. So again, to review, you've got the three types. Once in the winter, where no one can get in, the water, so you're only securing it and showing it from the inside. Also you have when John is on the outside but no one's on the inside and you can use that nice tight magnet uh, to secure the canvas and the plastic uh, banner material into place. Third is when everyone's on deck and everyone's available and he's on the inside, he's on the outside while I'm on the inside and you're securing it with this nut and bolt. Well. I hope you enjoyed this video. I would have loved to have done this with some water, but it just wasn't that possible. And if you like this video, please subscribe, ring the bell, tell your friends. Uh, and we'll see you again soon, everybody. Take care.